In table position, if your hands are at all sore, you can come up into your fists. So either way, wrists or fists. I'm going to go with the fists just to try something different tonight, today. Take the right leg back. Lift and bend. Now we're going to pulse. One, two, three. Bring the right knee in towards the chest. Stretch it out long. Bend. Lift, one, two, three. Breathe in towards your chest. Lengthen. Bend. Pulse, two, three. Bring in towards your chest. Lengthen. Bend. Pulse, two, three. Bring it down. Now, if at any time in that sequence you needed to bring the leg down and give a little release, that's fine. So how did it feel on your fists? Mine went okay. Second side, start with the left leg extending out, maybe a little calf stretch. Lift it straight, bend the knee, pulse, 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 left knee to chest, straighten it out. Bend your knee, lift your sole to the sky. One, two, three, sole of your foot that is, <laughs> into, the, into the chest. Straighten it out, bend your knee, lift two, three, into the chest, straighten it out, bend, one, two, three, one more in, in, out, bend, one, two, three, release down, child's pose, if you like child's pose, toes together, knees wide, stretch those glutes. And actually, even if um, you, you don't even really need to go all the way down to feel that nice stretch through those hips, you should have felt that. And with the knees wide like this, you're also getting those inner thigh, pelvic floor muscles maybe that are tight. And then back to center up into tabletop.